Dear friends at St George's, we're living in uh, what some people are saying are unprecedented times and I just want to share with you uh, the story of Jesus in the boat on the sea when the storm blows up. Of course he's asleep and the disciples are fearing for their lives, they think they're going to drown and they think Jesus doesn't care. Master, don't you care if we drown, they say, and uh, they wake him up and of course uh, Jesus, uh, supreme in his authority, calms the storm with uh, with a word and the wind and the waves they obey him and then actually what happens is the disciples uh, it says from they were they were of course they were scared stiff they were full of fear in regards to the storm but then they're full of fear in regard to the person of Jesus who is this man even the wind and the waves obey him and what I want to say to us as a church at this time is that Jesus is in the boat with us uh, he knows what we're going through he knows the fears that we feel but the one in the boat uh, is the one with all authority. He has authority over kind of uh, the effects of a fallen creation over the works of the evil one. He has the power to save. And his question to the disciples at the end of that story is, do you still have no faith? Where's your faith? It's not that um, we won't be anxious in times like these. But we are to keep our eyes on Jesus and he does call us to have and to place our faith in him because all authority over all things, even death itself, has been placed in the hands of Jesus. And so can I encourage us to be people of faith, even uh, in uh, some of the anxiety that some of us will be feeling at this time? And of course, to uh, be supporting and caring and praying for those who are most vulnerable in our society and in our own community at this time. May nobody be forgotten and uh, may we be able to meet the needs of those around us. God bless.